So we are currently uh, in the season of winter and I know it's super, super cold outside. Uh, I know the temperatures have dropped. It gets dark early. It's gloomy outside, all of that. Yes, we can look at it negatively, but guess what? Subhanallah, winter is a season of a believer. There are narrations of the Prophet ﷺ saying this. It's the spring of a believer. Ibn Mas'ud, he used to say, welcome to the winter season. Its days are short conducive for fasting and its nights are long conducive for standing in prayer if you really think about it we have a great opportunity in winter how so if you think about the days subhanallah they are so short it's super easy to fast literally maghrib is is by 4 p.m you can have your iftar and you can continue right the nights are longer which means that usually we struggle with the tahajjud the qiyam prayer but guess what after isha you have the whole night ahead you can pray qiyam al at any point uh, in that time. Also, uh, if you think about the struggles and the efforts that you're making in winter, you, you're making wudu, for example, you're walking to the masjid, it's cold, you're struggling. Guess what? There's good news for you because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran, He says, وَكَانَ سَعْيُكُمْ مَشْكُورًا That your efforts will most certainly be appreciated. Meaning that the more effort that we make in the winter, we're going to get more reward for it. Allah is not going to let that go. And also when it comes to giving in charity, we can look out for the homeless, for those who don't have uh, shelter in these freezing temperatures. There's so many ways of gaining rewards. Don't look at it negatively. As Muslims, we're taught to be positive, to be optimistic. So let's make use of this winter season.